welcome to our video comparison of Microsoft Teams and Zoom video conferencing apps. In this video, we'll help you decide which one is better for your needs. Let's start with the features. Microsoft Teams and Zoom both offer screen sharing, virtual backgrounds, and breakout rooms. However, Microsoft Teams also has a built-in whiteboard and allows for up to 10,000 participants in a meeting, while Zoom only allows up to 1,000. In addition, Microsoft Teams integrates well with other Microsoft apps, such as Outlook and OneDrive, while Zoom has integrations with apps like Slack and Dropbox. Overall, both apps have similar features, but Microsoft Teams offers more options for larger meetings and better integration with Microsoft apps. Moving on to pricing, both Microsoft Teams and Zoom offer free and paid plans. However, Microsoft Teams' free plan includes more features than Zoom's free plan, such as unlimited chat and search capabilities. In addition, Microsoft Teams' paid plans are slightly cheaper than Zoom's paid plans, with more options for larger organizations. Overall, Microsoft Teams offers more value for money, with more features in its free plan and cheaper paid plans for larger organizations. Finally, let's compare the ease of use. Both Microsoft Teams and Zoom have user-friendly interfaces, but Microsoft Teams has a more organized layout and easier setup process. In addition, Microsoft Teams has better accessibility features, such as live captions and transcripts, which can be helpful for people with hearing impairments. Overall, Microsoft Teams is easier to use and has better accessibility features, making it a better choice for people who value simplicity and inclusivity. To sum up, both Microsoft Teams and Zoom are great video conferencing apps, but Microsoft Teams offers more value for money, better accessibility features, and a more organized layout. Therefore, we recommend Microsoft Teams for professionals, students, and anyone who needs to use video conferencing apps.